So I'm Lisa, I've got two kids, Max is six and Willow is two. And uh, we've got this dog, obviously, Dudley. It's a very hairy dog. And um, a husband, the hairy northerner, I call him on my blog. I've been with my husband 23 years, which makes me old, <laughs> really old. Always safe even if it's just a pound. We had to really look at cutting down on our expenses when my husband got made redundant. I was much stricter for the kids. I just needed them to understand that we were buying what we had to have, not what would be nice to have. We actually managed to cut our costs by 50%. And you know what? It's not been a problem. The way that we do our finances has changed and adapted. It's actually quite good to have pots for money. The hairy northern, me and the kids. Then it can be really transparent. It tends to really work because then you're not quibbling about, oh, you spent on that, mm, you, like it. you know, that's sort the of thing. Maybe in a way the little children are our best teachers. They love just little things. It doesn't have to cost any money and it's fun and it's adventurous and they've taught me to have a rich life. We're going from big cars back to little cars, from glamping to camping, and we're going back to watching every £10 we spend. And I'm really inspired with ideas of what we can do. One thing we found was um, we looked at the gym membership because it's a monthly fee, and so we replaced it with more flexible ideas. So we walk the dog more as the kids and go and dancing, and it's much more flexible and easier to fit into life and actually I'm fitter and healthier. Savings can sound difficult to do, but once you start, it gets easier and easier. And my advice would be, just start saving. Give it a go and you'll find out that it's the best thing that you ever did. So that was my piggy bank tale. Share your money saving stories or tips you could win one of two £500 prizes which you can choose to invest in the Virgin Stocks and Shares ISA.